What is going on guys? It is week three of rounds in the bank here with JD and Matra in boxing. If you followed along the past two weeks, you know that we have set the pace. So we're gonna be bringing you one episode every week throughout the month of January. All these circuits are done by professional boxers. See how you compare up to a professional athlete and let us know how you get on. Right guys, I'm joined by Joel Thompson, who, by the way, you seem like you could do anything. You play tennis as a kid. Yeah. Your brother still does. Brother still does. Hermans, the world champion in karate. Yeah. Like, you're a big fat basketball alone. The moment I just threw me into sport, that was literally it, man. They just gave me every opportunity to do as much sport as I could, and I took full advantage of that. Today, we're going to go through a circuit that you would do around your training camp. Yeah. yeah. So, at what stage would you put this in, and how frequently would you do it? I say this. I do this probably around at the start of camp. So this is just more just getting you back into the swing of things. Um, not too intense, but you can vary the intensity of the circuit, make it as hard as you kind of want it. Um, but yeah, it's not a killer, but uh, it's tough. It's tough. As tough as you make it. Okay. Get warmed up. Walk me through it. Yep. And let me know what people at home can expect. Perfect. To begin with, we've got the double armed kettlebell swing. It gets the heart going a little bit once you once you get going, um, mainly for the legs, glutes, and onto the push-ups with the with the shoulder taps. And this one's all about trying to keep your hips as stable as you can when you're shoulder tapping. What we got here, goblet squat. Goblet squat. Everyone knows a goblet squat. Everyone knows a goblet squat. This one's just gonna get your legs yeah. burning up. Burning up. So we're doing the counter moving jumps, hands on hips. Yeah. Down, slight pause, explode up. It's all about explosive power. Then. All about explosive power. Yeah. One favorites? of my favourites. One of my favourites. So we've got bar slams. So down, up. <laughs> With that one, you just want to try and find a rhythm. Final, a little bit of shadow boxing. Nice and easy. You can pretend to be your favourite fighter. Muhammad Ali, Floyd Mayweather, anyone you want. Let's go. This is where we step it up again. Half of it. Last five seconds. Time. Push. Round two of five. Dos. Yeah. Round dos. Five. Been watching too much four, narcos. Three, two, one. Let's go. Nice and easy. Halfway there. Breeze. This is a breeze. Light work. Yeah. Last five seconds. Three. I must be two, it well. One. <laughs> Let's go. Yeah. <laughs> a little bit of a second. Good time. Five, four, three, two, one. Now this is where you step it up yeah. now. Step it up. Step it up. Increase your reps. Halfway there. Keep going. Five, four, three, two, one. Aim, Aim to jump through the roof on this one. Throw the ball through the floor on yeah, that one. Yeah, gotta get through the roof. Five, four, three, two, one. Three, two, one, time. Have some fun on this one this time. Yeah, let's get low. Try and find the rhythm. Let's get low, dig, dig those heels in. Three, work. two, one. Yeah. <coughs> oh, there we go, he's found the rhythm. <coughs> Halfway there. <coughs> Five, four. Three, two, one, time. There we go. That bowl bounce looked like it was a basketball. That's what it is. You want to get a little game. bounce to yeah, yeah. save your effort to pick it up. Three, two, one, let's go. Halfway there. Last five seconds. Time. 
Yeah, he was trying to put the ball through the floor, then it was bouncing up. I've seen that. The, the, the floor wasn't agreeing with me. <laughs> the yeah. floor didn't want it. So, the way you look at these things is like, when you're doing your jumps, your aim is to jump as high as possible. Yeah. But land safely. But land safely. Try and cushion the land. Cushion so you're not so you... putting all them shot, that shot yeah. through, your, through your body and your joints. And then bending correctly to get the ball yeah. up. And make Save the ball you bounce some lower a little bit. Yeah, <laughs> if you can, if you can, try and get a little bounce. And you'll catch it on the way back up. That's a good way yeah. of finding the rhythm as well. So yeah, yeah. It helps. Then you don't have to pick it up off pick the floor. Pick it up off the actual floor. It's so easier. Yeah. No, I get it. Double ended, yeah. Double ended swords. Double ended swords so are like. Exactly. You're giving it that more, that little bit more power so it yeah. bounces. So, so it you bounces. can stay a little bit higher. Yeah. <laughs> you know, see, you, you run it. Tricks of the trade. Yes, I know, sir. I know, yes, I know sir. It. Right, Smart last five seconds. <laughs> Four, three, two, one. Let's go. Whoosh. Workout look good. No, nah, it's good. Good. People at home will full body take that in. Get a good sweat on. Get a good sweat on like you. Be hard. So we're sweating just looking at that. I was yeah. like, yeah, that's enough for me for one day. Nah, that's enough. Yeah, you've been put through it. You've been put you smashed it. it. Thank you, my guy. Appreciate you, man. Sweaty. I know. Yeah, I know. We sweat too much. It does matter. I'm sweating myself. Anyway, yeah. so it's fine. <laughs> Don't forget to join us next week and carry it on. Let's go.